Hi, this is Mangreshan, Department of Chemistry, St. Joseph's College, Kadalu, Tamil Nadu. Selvathul Chellum, Sevichellum, Achellum, Selvathukillam Thalai, Thirukkural. Hi dear students, now we are going to see about an important topic that is quantum chemistry in that how to solve the Schrodinger wave equation for two dimensional box. In my previous video, we have solved one dimensional box for the wave function and energies. Now, the two dimensional box. So, two dimensional box, the particles is moving in two direction, x and y directions. Let's take an example as a rectangle. So, it can <coughs> two different lengths and it can move in two different directions. From the Schrodinger wave equation, that is a time independent Schrodinger wave equation, h cap psi equal to e psi. So, h is an Hamiltonian, this is time independent Schrodinger wave equation. For h cap equal to h square by 2m, h cross square by 2m, dou square by dou x square plus dou square by dou y square plus b psi equal to e psi. We know that potential energy of the particles inside that is v equal to 0. There is no potential energy. So substitute minus h cross square by 2m dou square by dou x square plus dou square by dou y square psi equal to e psi the next step minus h cross square by 2m dou square psi by dou x square plus dou square psi by dou y square is equal to e psi So now it is involved two variables one is x another one is y variables again you can write one more step also minus h cross square by 2m dou square psi by dou x square minus h cross square by 2m dou square psi by dou y square is equal to e psi then we go for the separation of the variables because two variables are there x and y for the one dimensional box it's not a problem because it is involved only one variables no need to separate but here we are in two variables x and y so you have to separate the variables separation of variables That is psi of x y is equal to x of x y of y. So substitute in above equation. Substitute in above equation and divided by x of x y of y. So resulting we are obtained as minus h cross square by 2m 1 by x dou square x by dou x square minus h cross square by 2m 1 by y dou square y by dou y square is equal to e so this is we are obtained next we have to separate the, the <coughs> each variable that is equal to n constant so we know that from the one dimensional we have solved this one also and this one is also because each one considered as a one dimensional box so for the two dimensional each one has an act as a one dimensional box so the same solution for the one dimensional box we are going to obtain here but we have to add both the dimensions minus h cross square by 2m 1 by x dou square x by 
do x square is equal to e x another one minus h cross square by 2 m 1 by y do square y by do y square equal to e y the total solution is e x plus e y is equal to e And for that the wave, wave, <coughs> wave function is equal to ax sin n x pi x by l x so this is for wave function in x direction then for the y direction equal to a y sin n y pi y by l y by this l means we are having some boundary condition x equal to 0 x equal to l y equal to 0 and y equal to l by applying these boundary conditions we are obtained the wave equation wave function sorry wave function now we are going to normalize the wave function for the now we are apply the normalization conditions is 0 to L psi star psi of dx and dy so that you can simply take note this like 0 of L dx 0 of L dy psi star and psi star of x direction y direction psi of x y directions take this way that is equal to 1. Now, the resulting we are obtained as, for the one dimensional we are obtained as square root of 2 by Lx. For another one, that is square root of 2 by Ly. For the one dimensional we are obtained as 2 by L, but we are here having two directions. So, square root of 2 by Lx and 2 by Ly. Now the complete wave function equal to x of y is equal to square root of 4 by lx ly sin of n x pi x by lx sin of n y pi y by ly. So this is for complete wave function of two dimensional box. For that energy that is E equal to, for the one dimensional that is N square, H square by 8M square. For the two dimensional energy is equal to NX square by LX square plus NY square by LY square h square by 8m if lx and ly are equal then it is taken as l now the energy is become equal to nx square plus ny square h square by 8m l square so this is for energy this is the energy for the two dimensional box thank you